once you're a homeowner, all of a sudden the things you care about are just so crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? I put up a fence and my neighbor was like, I was putting the nice side towards mine instead of the nice side towards his. And he goes, you got to put the nice side no, towards my yard. No way. And I go, why? It's my fence. I'm building the fence. He goes, in the, because we have a homeowners association. He's like, in the homeowners association charter, it says that you have to put them. And I'm like, I was so mad because I didn't know what it said. I go, all right then. And I had to switch it. Wait, 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 wait. I was so mad. I cussed him a little bit. Now we're friends again. He's an old man. And we had nothing, we had done nothing but small talk each other uh, for two years. How did he and approach you though? And I told the though? man to go F himself out there. And I was like, where did that come from? Uh, but but you had already put the fence up? It was in process of being put up. Luckily, those guys were very nice and they're like, we'll switch it. They were. Is that, that's just homeowners. That's not a law. Yeah, just homeowners. Yeah. You have to put. I've still not read it, but I bet he has. That's all I mean. What if, this... but by the way, I could see him being the. It's like, well, it's in the manual. He yeah. hasn't read it. You haven't read yeah. it. There's probably no manual. I know. But he knows your you the chances of you reading it are so small. The chances of you changing the fence are higher than reading yeah. it. I had to move out of my last home because a ru my Russian neighbor jumped my fence, cut down 10 of my trees. Oh, yeah. Cut down fully grown, I think 60, 60 foot tall yeah. uh, pine trees. Wow. Cut them down. Unbelievable. Yeah. She and should go back to Russia. He. He. And then I, I. Why did I think it was a woman? I. That's some catty. <laughs> okay, okay. Some catty. <laughs> <laughs> she came over with her nail clippers. Yeah, yeah. It was. It was. It was interrupting her view. She wanted yeah. to take selfies, and the trees were in the way. <laughs> that is funny. Comes over, and then I go to confront him. He looked like Kato Kalin had like a long. He was like blonde Theo Vaughn, but like like super big dude. Jeans had the stitching, like the yellow stitching on the side. Oh, yeah. Cowboy boots. When a Russian is wearing cowboy boots, get the f out of yeah. there. Turn around. You're going to lose. There's no hope for yeah. you, dude. And then I go up to him. I'm so pissed off. And I was like, you cut down my trees. And, blah, blah, blah. and I was, and he goes, how do you know they're your trees? In like a thick Russian accent. I'm not going to do the accent. I don't want Lauren Michaels calling. Um, and I was like, uh, uh, you cut down my trees. And he's like, how do you know they're your trees? And I'm like, because there's a fence. He goes, how do you know the fence is in the right place? The Russian guy's like, how do you know the fence is in the right place? And you're like, ah, I, I don't. don't. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. I was like, as I was saying it, I was like, I could see him being like, it's in the owner's manual that you can't do that. I can yeah. see myself saying that to a neighbor. Yeah. Like, you don't know about the homeowner's pamphlet? Right. Volume four, Roman numeral F. Yeah, when you get called, you're like, ah. I think you need to read this manual. I should read the manual. I think, I think and then if he's wrong, I'll go switch the fence myself. <laughs> go, guess what? Just read the manual. No, he has to pay for it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I live for a petty neighbor dispute, dude. There is a show in England about neighbor disputes that escalated to one of them killing the other one. Wow. Yeah, it gets wild. I mean, it's not really a problem for me. I mean, most of my neighbors are, you know, just as, you know, we're like a same kind of redneck level, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? But this guy, he's a little older. He has a very nice lawn. He didn't want the fence because he liked the open space of my yard and his yard. But I'm like, I got kids now. I can't have them run into the road. Yeah. I got to trap them in. Yeah, 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 So yeah, we yeah. really talked about it. I thought we had it really worked out, but uh -huh. I feel like deep down, he uh -uh. was still a bit bitter about it. There's something so primal about someone's behavior like 80 feet away from you. Yeah. It's, it's tough. But it's like, you know, it's like also when you live close, it's like, I like talking to them, but I don't want to talk every time I'm in the backyard. You got to, you know, you have to, but the fence now you're like, you, you don't, you don't see them. Oh, it's a tall fence. It's not that tall, but you can, it, there is some division. You, you know live next I mean? to Brad Williams. You can't see him. Yeah. Yeah. Over the Actually, fence. my neighbor behind me put up an eight foot privacy fence, which I don't think is allowed, but I didn't mind it. I'm going to get some vines to grow up that thing.